When it comes to architectural projects, it is generally better to start with the planning phase before settling on a specific form or design. Proper planning lays the foundation for a successful architectural project and helps ensure that the final design meets the project's objectives, budget, and requirements. Here's why planning should come first. Understanding objectives and requirements, the planning phase allows the architect and the project stakeholders to clearly define the objectives, needs, and requirements of the project. This includes understanding the purpose of the building, the desired functionality, the intended users, the site conditions, and any specific constraints or regulations. Site analysis, during the planning phase, a thorough site analysis is conducted. This helps the architect understand the site's context, topography, climate, surrounding buildings, and other factors that may influence the design. The site analysis informs the architectural concept and design decisions. Concept development. Based on the project's objectives and site analysis, the architect can develop a strong conceptual idea that guides the overall design. This concept serves as the framework for the entire project and ensures coherence and consistency in the final design. Feasibility studies. Planning allows for feasibility studies to be conducted. These studies assess the viability of the project in terms of budget, timeline, and technical requirements. Identifying potential challenges early on helps avoid costly changes later in the design process. User needs and experience. Planning allows architects to consider the needs and experience of the building's users. This user-centric approach ensures that the design is functional, practical, and enjoyable for those who will inhabit the space. Sustainability and energy efficiency. Early planning enables architects to incorporate sustainable design principles and energy-efficient strategies from the start. Sustainable practices can significantly impact the building's long-term environmental impact and operating costs. Collaboration and communication. The planning phase encourages collaboration between the architect, clients, consultants, and other stakeholders. Effective communication at this stage ensures that everyone's expectations are aligned and potential issues are addressed early in the process. Once the planning phase is complete and the project objectives and parameters are well-defined, the architect can proceed to the design phase where they explore different forms, aesthetics, and architectural solutions that best fulfill the project's requirements. In summary, starting with proper planning ensures that the architectural project is well-informed, feasible, and aligned with the intended goals. Thanks for watching. If it helps you then like and subscribe my channel.